taking his state office for the first time, a Hoosier Muslim American man. And supporters say it's not only a big victory for the Muslim community, but one for any Hoosier looking to make Indiana a better place. News 8's multicultural reporter Katira Winfrey joins us with more on that. Well, Brooke Fadi, Fadi Kadora beat out incumbent Republican Senator John Ruckel's house for District 30. There are a lot of issues that are important to him, and education is a top priority. But equally important, he says, making sure people have diverse representation in local government. The road to the state house is one Fadi Kadora had faith he'd see. He's the first Muslim American to take office in the Indiana State Senate. It's a far cry from where he was 15 years ago. He survived Hurricane Katrina and homelessness. For the fact that I'm standing before you as senator-elect who came to the United States as an immigrant, who happens to be a Muslim, is a testament to the fact that things are possible in our state. Going up against an incumbent as a Democrat may have seemed to some a far reach, but Kadora says when your focus is on making our state a better place, Hoosiers can latch on to the idea. This election showed us that we can definitely come together. We can, uh, as Americans, uh, celebrate our values. He has several priority issues in this race, including common sense gun reform, infrastructure, affordable health care, and education. We need to stabilize our educational system by investing in teachers, being sure that teachers and students are protected in our local school systems, that our schools are fully funded that our teachers receive the pay increases that they deserve. As Muslim Americans continue to face adversity, this win is big. The community is overjoyed and we're very proud and uh, this is definitely a historic moment. But Ghidorah says he will cross religious, ethnic and partisan lines. I want to be sure that I create that path not only for American Muslims in Indiana, but for every person who feels that I need someone to represent me. And although Kador won the election, Ruckel's house on his Facebook page congratulated him on this win and says he wishes him the best as he passes the torch. You can read more about Kador's plan on our website, wishtv.com. Reporting in the studio, I'm Wish TV News 8's multicultural reporter, Katira Winfrey.